you are going to get taught technique and drills. Drills to drill the techniques. A fight is not a drill. A fight is not a technique. All these drills that have multiple, multiple things in them, what you should be learning is not, this is the drill that I'm going to do in a fight. This is the sequence with which I'm going to fight. What you should be learning is, here are 10 little parts, or five little parts, or three little parts, and any one of them may present themselves in a fight. Okay, uh, Muay Thai guys are prime examples of this. Um, to get any kind of rank, you've got to do the 15 count drill, the 17 count drill, and the 21 count drill. There is no guy on this planet that's going to let you do 17 techniques in a row back to back. It, the techniques that they're specifying. You may throw 17 techniques, but he's not going to be there for some of them. Or he's going to block some of them and stop you. So what you learn is how to just throw them. You learn the drill just so you can practice them, but then you come to recognize, oh, things have changed. Oh, I remember this. Boom, ba. Not that this is guaranteed the way it's going to happen. Remember at the outset, I said the only reason he's throwing the jab is because I want you, your partner, to be ready. More than likely, it's going to be just the John Wayne, and I have to be ready. And now I have to find this hand in order to do this technique. And it may be that he throws it. Oh, whoop, there it is. Or it may be that I go for it. But now that I've gone for it, I'm in a different position. So that technique is not necessarily available. I might hit him, control. Oh, now it's available. 